Hi there, I'm Susan Poole, the Bed and Breakfast Coach, and welcome to another video. This video is about five ways to increase your revenue. Did you know it's cheaper to make more money from existing customers than going out and sourcing new ones? And it doesn't matter the business, whether you're a store, a business, or a bed and breakfast. Now you might be wondering why I'm telling you this when you don't even own a bed and breakfast yet. But the whole point is, if you understand this concept and start using it right from the beginning, then you're going to have uh, some strong skills in increasing your revenue. And it's always easier to learn from the beginning rather than introduce new skills at a later date. So why is it easier to make money from existing customers? That's because people buy from who they, other people that they know, like, and trust. And once you have a relationship, whether it's through your website, travel reviews, or because they've been an existing guest, then you can use those, that relationship to increase revenue from them. And here are the five ways that I suggest. The first one is try to increase the length of their stay. Uh, you do that through your website, having uh, things to see and do and uh, events pages on the website. You can uh, combine all that information and create a free downloadable travel guide. Or if you have the opportunity, you can tell them over the phone about what's happening around the time that they're booking. So perhaps that they'd be interested in extending their stay. Secondly, create add-ons or packages. Lots of people come to bed and breakfast to celebrate special occasions. And this is the perfect time for you to uh, offer, uh, it could be a basket, it could be a package, it's up to you. Uh, you can put in things like flowers, balloons, breakfast in bed, massages. The list is endless and uh, as long as it's something that would appeal to the majority of your guests, uh, because you know who you want as your guests. If you have vacancies, you can offer guests uh, special discounts for staying extra nights. Um, and a good example of this would be to think about um, resorts. Not that long ago, I was at an all-inclusive resort, and they obviously had vacancies because they offered uh, a deep discount to stay uh, another week. I wish I could have. Uh, but make sure that uh, you do it in such a way that they don't uh, expect that discount to apply to their whole stay. The other thing you can do is offer different, a variety of different room rates based on the type of rooms that you offer. If you have the chance, upgrade somebody to a better room and that way if they come back uh, they now know the value uh, that's related to that uh, extra cost and chances are you'll find a lot of people will go back and uh, next time reserve the more expensive room. And finally, don't overlook gift certificates. These uh, are great and can be uh, used year-round for special occasions. They're great to promote uh, special occasions too around Christmas time or Mother's or Father's Day, that kind of thing. And uh, when you have your uh, marketing materials drawn up, don't forget to ask for a uh, gift certificate to be drawn up, a template that you can fill in the blanks for when people order them. The only thing you have to keep do is make sure you keep track of uh, the gift certificates that are out there because depending on where you're located how long it is until they expire or if they do expire so you need to know that information so the other thing you need to do in order to make this all work is to know what your costs are and don't forget to include the time that it, you put into creating these baskets or packages. So anyone who has a sales and marketing background knows it's cheaper to, to upsell an existing customer than to go out and find new ones. And now you understand why and you know how to go about that. 
If you like this video, please check the please click on the subscribe button over to the right so that you're notified when new videos are posted. And why not head over to my website at www.bandbcoach.com and start your journey towards owning a bed and breakfast by downloading our free ebook, Three Questions Everyone Who Wants to Own a Bed and Breakfast Asks or Should. And that will help you take the guesswork out of owning a bed and breakfast. That's great. And until now, until next time, take care. Bye for now.